Hey, Matthew Swinnerton here from Event Santa Cruz, and I'm here with... John Rawls, non map branding, graphic design, as well as a couple of fun local sites. I feel you do like everything. Like when somebody <laughs> asks you like, what do you do, John? What do you say? I'm a marketer. So okay. I, I say that I'm a marketer and I'm, I'm well steeped in social media, online media, websites, search engine optimization, all, all of that, whatever that entails, <laughs> as well as uh, more traditional media. But really what it comes down to is I think I have a head for boiling marketing down to the abstract, figuring out what people want, what they're looking for, when they're looking, okay. and putting that into whatever media I'm looking at, whether that's Instagram or magazines, right? Yeah. Whatever that is, we're, we're good at boiling down to the, the core element of what's actually going to make people happy and keep people entertained. So how did this start? How did like you become this marketing guru? What, what was like, <laughs> yeah, was it like a, you know, this is what I want to do or this, it was an accident? Like, you know, how this happen? <laughs> uh, oh, please never call me a guru. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's so funny. Someone said a, a guru in like one of the last interviews and I thought the same thing. Stuck now. Yeah, <laughs> so, but, so I know what you mean. Yeah, sorry. Um, Expert, marketing expertise, <laughs> expert, um, yeah. So, I've been on, I, I tend to go, personality wise, I tend to go on deep dives into material. When I get excited about something, when I get interested in something, I will spend an unlimited amount of hours. I will spend months and months and months diving yeah. into it. I'll read everything that I can about it. My wife likes to joke at me in my yeah. piles of books because I'll go to a bookstore and buy technical manuals and I'll go to college bookstores just to buy books and she goes you know you're messing with their classes by doing that right because <laughs> I, I have this this thirst to figure everything out yeah. when I go on these dives okay. into materials and people are the most fascinating and coolest thing in the world I absolutely love people I I've always wanted to understand what makes people tick what people love about their lives what sucks about people's lives and that's why i ended up in marketing i think or that's the closest yeah uh that's the closest analogy i guess to to where i am is marketing is a way that i can make money understanding how people tick yeah and ideally do that ethically without <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> not like the traditional 1970s ad man just yeah. wants to sell widgets so in the morning when you wake up, I mean, obviously, because you, you have your love of people, what like what drives you in the morning, like when you wake up, like, oh, I'm excited about this. What is that? What is, what is this? Yeah. So in addition to deep diving into other people, I've definitely gone through deep dives into myself and understanding what makes me tick. And I have to have, to, to get up and be excited in the morning, I have to have a big vision. And right now that big vision is media sites. That big business is the entertainment side of media where I can create things like localsantacruz.com, which is an arts website that offers free promotional materials for artists to help them ideally sell and move art, be able to sell art, make money on yeah. art without me having to take a cut of that at all, without taking a piece of that. Or another one I'm working on right now is uh, BizarreBay.com, which is essentially a, a tourism travel adventure site for the Monterey Bay area with a huge focus on mermaids and Bigfoot and space aliens, <laughs> right? Complete tongue in cheek, yeah. <laughs> onion level, fun <laughs> junk. But at the same time, you get to see out and about in Santa Cruz, which yeah. is absolutely gorgeous. And we have people doing amazing things across the board yeah. and in the Bay, so. Well, well, that's what I want to ask you about. And that, that makes me think <laughs> about it. like, Working here in Santa Cruz, um, do you feel that that is uh, enhanced what you do? <laughs> so after college, I left Santa Cruz right. because I realized that I couldn't. I grew up here, left after college because I realized uh, all my friends were bartending and working service industry. I was doing the same mm -hmm. and I couldn't stand it. I couldn't see becoming something in the service industry and so I left specifically with the goal to figure out my own business figure out what I could do to make money so I could afford to move back to Santa Cruz okay. uh, 
So, um, <laughs> yeah, yeah, so, yeah, basically, yeah, so the, the, I guess my question was, yeah, so, so you do, I mean, like, Santa Cruz definitely has a oh, big yeah. impact. Santa Cruz um, has a massive impact. There, yeah. There's nowhere I'd rather be. I yeah. absolutely love Santa Cruz. I plan on traveling. I plan on spending months here and there. We're working on a, a handful of sites in North Carolina right now, and I've spent a little bit of time out there. I'd love to build a, a set of sites in New York. There's some places in Florida I really like to spend time, but Santa Cruz is my home. I'm very much in love with Santa Cruz. Nice. So if somebody wants to know more about like what you do, they need to help get their brand out, their story, um, where do they find you? Instagram is actually probably the best way to connect with me right now. I'm at J-N-R-W-L-S on Instagram. Uh, you can reach out to me through any of my brands, Nombat, Local SC, Bizarre Bay. Uh, I'm very active uh, in the leadership of all of those properties, but uh, at John Rawls or at J-N-R-W-L-S, John Rawls without any vowels, <laughs> is probably the best way to find me. Great. Okay. Well, I love what you do. I'm always excited to see you. Like you seem like you're doing you know, all these really cool projects and um, look forward to seeing more throughout the years. Excellent. Thank you very much, Matthew. Yeah, thanks. Hey, I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did and you want to see more, why don't you subscribe to our channel? We would really appreciate it. And also, make sure you turn on your notifications because then if you do, you'll be the first one to actually see our video. And lastly, again, if you like the video, why don't you like the video? Okay, thank you very much.